We don't need no education, said no finance minister ever. Thousand engineers will be offered handsome stipends and Prime Minister research fellowships so that they don't become investment bankers. Just kidding, it's so that they can be incentivized to do PhDs at IITs and IISC. And you know, stay in the field that they've actually studied. 24 new medical colleges will be set up all across the country, coming to school. On tribal education, the government has announced that by 2022, which is four years from now, every block with more than 50% ST population will have Eklavya schools which are at par with the Navodaya Vidyalayas. Jaitli ji also said that we need to move from the blackboard to the digital board. So the government is likely to focus on digital education as part of its larger Digital India program. But how will all of this help if there aren't enough trained teachers? So they've also announced a new program called Diksha in which 13 lakh untrained teachers will receive formal training. All in all, the total allocation on education, health and social security has gone up from 1.22 lakh crores to 1.38 lakh crores. In the opening lines of his budget speech, Arun Jaitley today said that the government has managed to get more children to schools but the quality of education still remains a concern. Do you think that reality will change? Tell us in the comments below.